I like to do a lot of stuff for my dad. He's having to grow up a little bit more and help me a lot more where I should be the one helping him. But, you know, we kind of work together and watching him and, and seeing how he... He's such a caring person. He does a lot of fun stuff for me, and so that means I have to do stuff for him too. And it's pretty cool. I, as you can imagine, I was kind of shocked and forward, and I didn't really think or do much for at least a month. ALS stands for amyotrophic lateral sclerosis. It's a neurological disease that is neurodegenerative. It slowly kills all of your muscles in your body. So you just get weaker and weaker and weaker. And at the end, I think the only way you can describe it is you're just a prisoner in your body. So there's a lot of things going through my mind, and I just kind of said, all right, well, it is what it is. Let's rock and roll and keep moving forward. USC put me in a, a multidisciplinary clinic, which is kind of like a round robin of doctors. So I come in and I would see seven or eight doctors. It's stressful living with ALS, man. You wouldn't believe it. And having to go see all these doctors all the time, it's nice being able to get in one building and see all of them. It's a good idea, whoever came up with it. Thank you. I think overall with ALS, I think it's knowing that there is something physical therapy can provide. A lot of people think that ALS is something that's just happening to them, but I do believe that people can improve their quality of life, and that might mean breathing more easily, sitting up better, not being as tight. So the things that we can provide can make someone a lot more comfortable as they're going through this, and making sure that they're still able to participate in their lives. You know, at the end of the day, it's, you can roll over and take it and wither away, right? But that's the easy way out. I mean, I've got a child, and I have a mission to make sure of Even if I'm not going to be here to watch him grow, I'll make it to see him become a man. So that's, you know, one of the main things that, that's why I'm here, that's why I'm fighting it. I do believe in ALS, having somebody on your team helping you get through this condition is very helpful. So I think that the therapy can um, help them have realistic expectations and an outlet as well in order to kind of share what's going on in their lives. My strength comes from my son and seeing him grow up. That's my role. If I didn't have a child, I don't know where my strength would be coming from right now. He's the driving factor that gives me strength and the inspiration to keep doing things, to not give up. The most powerful thing that I think any human can do is love someone.